Yeah, seems. okay, this might be it right here where the car, oh, oh. it slams into that semi and there's no way this car's so going anymore. So the door anymore. already the, the door open, is open and he's already now and trying to get we, out. We got a footbell. We got two people inside there of the vehicle. They're running out and, you know, who knows if they're armed. Keep in mind, this is on a very busy freeway. You got the 91. Um, but Went over the side there now. The two suspects running, trying to get away. But when you've got that much Air Force in front and of you. And now driving into oncoming traffic. So people coming on the other side of the freeway might not even have known what was coming. And now these two guys got out of their car jumped onto the other side of the freeway and are running through traffic. And unfortunately, because of all those cars, it's, it's kind of hard to see exactly where they are. We know that there are ground crews. There are also air crews keeping an eye. So I don't know if they think they can get away. There's definitely a lot of eyes on them, but uh, but it isn't a tough situation. They're out of breath already. So, you know, they can only run so far. And, and we've seen this before where, you know, the suspects get out of the car and, and, and start rolling or and start running. Um, but Imagine being one of those drivers. I mean, don't stop because they could potentially hijack you and, and take your car. All right, putting and, their arms up now, getting down on the ground. Okay, you see CHP officers right there. Kind of coming um, from all directions. Finally, the end to a pursuit that could have ended pretty badly, but unfortunately, there's a lot of victims. You can see they put their hands up. Thankfully, you've got the, the officers right there who, who are taking this person into custody. But to give you a little bit of background information, this all started as a burglary out in Walnut. And 